Did you do the exterior shots? The, uh, well, the we rented a, a ship in uh, Mombasa, Kenya, and then we sailed out into the Indian Ocean towards the border of Somalia. Were you worried about pirates? <laughs> well, we were very worried about pirates, and we brought we brought uh, armed guards to protect us. Um, and then we shot the whole thing in three weeks out there, sailing in and out of Mombasa. We, we had our production base in the harbor of Mombasa, and then we sailed out. And I'd made an agreement with with the with the um, with the producers that I would look at the monitor and direct the film, and they would look at the horizon, making sure that nobody came close to us, together with the armed guards. So, so I, I never really realized in the three weeks how dangerous it was, except for one situation, where I, I came over to have some coffee, and then two of the armed guards stood and discussed how they were packing their guns if pirates should come. And what they told me was, or what they told each other was, that they, they needed to put in a different kind of bullets, because if they only had full metal jackets, that would go right through the body of the skinny Somali people, and that wouldn't kill them and stop them. So they needed something else. So they, they, they sat there and caught in their old bullets so that they made sure that they, they would explode in the body of these guys, killing them. So right in that situation, I felt like maybe we should just have done this in a studio. I was a little scared, but then <laughs> we were busy and I, I, we kept on going. When I came back, I realized the danger we were in or the, the, the risk we had taken. But I felt it was necessary to do this uh, film as close to reality as possible. There are two prisons, I suppose.